Here at home, thousands hit the pavement this morning, raising money for the Roanoke Rescue Mission. While the drumstick dash didn't set an attendance record, organizers say it will likely set a fundraising record, meaning continued support feeding the homeless. All right, you're set. This is what it looks like when 12,500 people wake up on Thanksgiving morning and throw on some running clothes to make a difference. After months of planning, it all comes together as racers take their mark. My favorite part is just actually seeing all of the people that wave of runners as they start up Franklin Road. All sorts of people say that they see people down here once a year that they don't see during the year. So it's like a big family reunion, a friend reunion. Marking a new decade, this Thanksgiving Day reunion has raised nearly $2 million in the first 10 years. The money feeds local homeless families. We make enough money today to, for the food budget for the whole year. Croissant sandwiches. Most look forward to eating after the 5K, but one group has made tailgating at the Dash a Thanksgiving morning tradition. Several families from Bonsac Baptist Church come together, eat a spread, and teach their kids about serving others. I think it's incredible that the whole community gets together. Just the energy, um, people are vibrant. Uh, I love just uh, how on the different corners people come and um, play music and just celebrate the season. I'm very thankful to be able to do what I'm doing at my age. 73 year old Harold Ingram ran his 10th drumstick dash with his granddaughters, Cora and Sydney. All three received awards for their age group, but this year the girls have bragging rights at the dinner table. I beat Grandpa! Another generation makes holiday memories at the dash.